America! Hello and welcome back everyone, it's Snowhead420 and like I said last time, we're jumping right into this. I'm gonna leave this little stupid army for this army right here. We'll clean up these Brits with my one that's moving from the north. And this one, this is it. We're going in, we're gonna fight these little guys here. They'll get two more units, but uh, I don't think it's gonna be that big of a deal. We'll take them on. To battle! See. Siege! Let's do it! We're going in! Alright, so, uh, <clears throat> this is going to, uh, put, well, this will put, uh, Great Britain down to its last place, which we'll collect next turn, and that'll be removing Great Britain from the North American continent, which would be pretty sweet. I'm pretty excited about that, and I suspect all of you are as well. I'm sorry for the Brits that are being pushed off this land, but hey, historically we, uh, we did do it. So, what didn't happen, though, was what's going to come next, and that will be a return favor. The old stars and stripes will be uh, will be making their way over to the the joy land of Great Britain. And we'll be putting a hurting on their on their local ha local farms and territories, peoples and populace. We will be giving you the finger right back. Look at this. Okay, so it's a. Uh, well, it's another Indian-based reservation style. No, I shouldn't say that. That was terrible. Not reservation. Indian-based city um, <clears throat> occupation here that's being held. Even though it's Great Britain, it's uh, yeah, an Indian town or a Native American town. Wow, I'm just terrible right now. Okay, let's set up our cannon. Uh, you know what? I'm actually, since they're all howitzers, we're going to put you down here in the gully. Yep. In the gully. And I'll start off with that carcass shot. And let's see. Our line infantry minus the weakling. And that weakling. And even this weakling. Yes. Yes. Alright, well, this is not. Well, that'll do. Some of you are not stretched out as much as I would like, but that'll be just fine for now. Alright, so the weakling. Who didn't get collected? Oh yes, okay. And you, and you, sir. You shall take on the left. And we're going to hide you with the trees. I'm going to try and use some dirty tactics back, since I know they have a couple tribal gunners. What? I can't catch a break? You know what? Just just hide like that, alright? And our cav units here. We'll take even farther on the flank. Uh, General. General, stop! Dragoons, you guys can run out. Uh, you stand back here. And all of you cav will take you out over here. Oh yeah, someone's gonna get run over. Wow. All right. No hiding? I know they have some cav. There's their howitzers. Oof. Okay. Cav forward. Let's silence their guns. And... Watch out for these guys streaming across. Go! And you guys bring up the left. Are we gonna make it? Yeah. <clears throat> we are gonna make it. Alright, so now my howitzer team. Fire right here, please. Oh, long wise, get him. Oh, he, he missed. Oh, look at that, though. Oh, one of them's going to hit. Oh, oh, man, they're just blanketing in fire and not getting killed. Oh, wow. All right, take on this. Get rid of them. No howitzers for you. 
You tried to shoot at me, but to no. Oh, look at that. I hate when the computer does that. Okay. Try to fight along my line here. Not going to work out to your benefit, I'm telling you right now. Move it up. Alright, so get out of here. Let's not get shot. <clears throat> Alright. Let's see if we can't pull this off. Come on, boys. Here it comes. Charge! No square formation for you. Just push through them, totally disrupt their lines. And then right as they think they're okay, boom, from behind. Another cav unit just wrapping them up. Aye. You know, if they already fired off their line, let's just charge. Line infantry is doing well. Of course. Oh, stop, 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 cannons. Ah! Oh! I just murdered my own calf. Oh my gosh. Wow, I couldn't stop it. It was already in flight. Oh. I am so sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh. You sons of bitches. Firing squad, prepare. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. For your insubordination and lack thereof of listening to the orders given to you by a direct officer and superior, I hereby sentence you all to death. Fire when ready. Say, I'm not firing into my own friend. I know that man right there. I went to school with him. I said, fire! <laughs> Gosh damn it. Oh, that was... Oh. That was sad. That was really sad. I am... I am hurt. Wounded deeply. Wounded deeply here. I cannot believe I massacred so many of my own boys. Just look at it. All those horse. They didn't need to die. They did not need to die. Just wrap up the rest of these. Get some experience. And... Call it good. <clears throat> Aside from the hefty... Friendly fire there. I think... That calf was outstanding. And they would have been all present here at the end of the battle to say we did a damn good job instead they will all be very sad faced worried about their brother no longer existent to us today today and facing the bottom of a bottle gosh damn it ah <sighs> beautiful calf kills hundred calf 227 uh -huh. just look at that they rode gloriously into battle and were disgraced upon gosh damn All right. Well, victory we have. No money to uh, support the uh, repairing of this place, unfortunately. But we're okay here as far as public order is concerned. And some random fort over here. That's cool. Um, let's see. All the buildings are appropriate. Excellent. So that means uh, we'll have ourselves a free army here. We can take the fight over here to uh, the Black Hills if we want to investigate that. We have ourselves our army marching down here to, uh, well, what the hell happened here? 
we were going to leave the Cherokee Nations, that's right, because you guys wanted to uh, see just what happens to them in the Mediterranean, as well as all these crazy uh, changes that have occurred here with the, um, you know, the, the diplomatic standpoint of things. They like to give them some <laughs> trade, trade cities, which is really, really weird. Uh, so my rake, I will, uh, let's see, was he getting any ex- Oh. My watchword. Can I assassinate somebody? Thirty-one percent. Not exactly a lot. What uh? What about uh? Oh shoot! I have to get out. Um. You know what? Just stay there, and that's you'll just get experience by staying there. All right. So I'll save you guys the turn flip because that's what I'm about to do. Everything else is moved, and uh, well, here it goes. All right. Well, I will show you what happened here. Not a lot. Our agent recruited. Um, really. That's nice. So nice of you to join us in the party. What more can I do? Oh, uh, you should go up here actually, and turn this over to protest. Prot <laughs> wow. <laughs> hey, I don't even even try. I don't care. It's too hard. All right, we're going to fall back here. This is the army that was down here. It walked up north, trying to take down our moose factory. Not happening. We will stuff you. Get rid of this. Get rid of our construction, recruitment, and a successful mission by our rake. Now, this is where the British army decided to land. Uh, three units of line infantry. I will have a militia, a Minutemen, and of course, two other militia, I suspect. Um, chances are they could take me on that one which would be really annoying, but we do have this uh, this army here, which can leave, and we'll be able to fix this situation here with no problemo. I wonder if, uh, you know what, I might actually be better off with using a cav unit. I keep clicking the other button, there we go. Even though they'll probably attack me before it's completed. I would sail them over there now, but we'd have to fight the navy, and that's not happening. Uh, you guys remember they have multiple second rates and third rates, which we only have, well, we have a third rate and fourth rates. We have two second rates only. So we're just, we're not, we're not getting there yet. I need to put some more money into that, but right now the money is not exactly flowing. Next turn, it looks like we'll have some more. Well, we're going to get this back here as we attack this place. Looks like I have a couple units for potential reinforcements, which we will take advantage of. And as well here, we can repair this, and that'll be getting us some money next turn as well. We can also get ready to move, and like I said, we'll have to figure out if we want to go over to the Black Hills over there or not. And this, uh, well, I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do here. I guess we march down um, to pick a war with Afghanistan. Totally that makes sense. Uh, I think we'll actually just go and do that now. And then we'll figure out how we're going to, or how long we're going to wa wait and watch the uh, Cherokee Nations and give them the opportunity to do what they want to do. Uh, and that's kind of up to you guys. So as soon as we want to kill them, we will kill them. Otherwise, we have this army of guns here, which is going to be good. Add to this unit, which is exactly four short. We'll have a lot of cannon in this army. I am, That is going to be sweet. As well, we have some specialty units coming on down. That is also incredible. I like that. Okay, cool. Then, let's get into this fight. Sir. Orders. Let's do this. You guys got a howitzer as well as 8-inch mortar. I'm not looking forward to that. I have one cab unit of dragoons, and they have two of mounted auxiliary. We have more line infantry than them straight up, which is good. And I don't believe those, uh, well, it doesn't matter actually. Um, we'll see here, what kind of tactic we'll be able to deploy. We don't have any great advantage, it's just going to be a straight up fight. So we'll have to look to terrain to give us some kind of edge on them. What will it be? Not always high ground, but that's, you know, the big one. But hiding units behind hills is also very effective. 
Hmm. We'll have to see when we get to look at the damn map. There we go. Grass. Uh, you can always hide in grass. Now, grass. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Houses. Buildings. That's what we have to play with here. It's close combat. Wow. We do have some room to maneuver on the right with some tree cover. Maybe the dragoons will be deployed on that side. I don't have much going on over here on the left. We'll be fighting uphill and into houses on their part. So we can move through here to diminish their ability to use their howitzer to some extent. Uh, I think I might put my guns on either side. I think I might do that. I mean, let's see if we get... This way, the houses will have less ability to uh, cover them. Although the howitzer does the shine, shoot, and you know, rainbow down on top of them. Wow, the left side sucks. I don't know if I want to put my gun over there at all. Hmm. Hmm. Well, well, well. Do I put it in the trees as well? I mean, I have pretty good chance that they're not going to shoot the tree in front of them, right? Oh, and they're even hiding! Ah! I didn't know you can have a cannon unit hide in the forest! Huh. You know, you learn something new all the time. And 60% of the time, it's right every time. Alright, so right up front here with the howitzers, we're going to put our fancy... Do -do 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 -do's. Uh, bow. Our Continental Marines. All right, good. And uh, our New Yorker. You guys are gonna go on the left, along with two more line infantry. Foot of the line. You guys want to go through the housing or the city? Okay, that's cool. I'm down. I mean, you're hiding behind this. You know, you go to... What is that? I don't know what it is. Random house that has kind of a castle-like setup to it. Always one in a house that looks like a castle. Or is a castle. That'd just be great. Uh, another infantry unit. We will put you over here. Behind the guns. And you will walk through them and deploy up here on the ridge. So I should probably just start you up here. Alright. Let's roll! So they're firing up the middle. Using... Oh, I use solid shot. Oh, they're on fortified position. Ah, oh, gosh damn. Alright, give them carcass shot here. And, uh... You know, you guys aren't going to take that much in loss here, actually. This is cool. Alright, move up. And you guys in the far left flank here, you're going to have it the easiest. I thought it was going to be difficult, but it's not. Move up. So we'll move up through the house here. Huh. You know what? Move up here. We might. We're just going to go straight into him. I'm just going to hold my right flank for now. It's going to be a left wheel movement only. Yes and no. Okay. So you're going to fire here and you're going to fire here. Oh, damn mortar shots. Now those are going to do some damage. Oh, just look at this shrapnel falling. Oh. Sorry, lads. I really am. Alright. You guys have got to run it up. We're taking too many hits over here. You must silence their guns, man!
thinking about occupying this house. Well, now we're talking. Talk about killing the... Uh, <laughs> yeah. So you gotta drop it in front so it can mow through the line. That's the way that carcass shot works. It's a carpet bomb, basically. I mean, carpet firebomb. Alright. So you guys... Come over here. Deploy on their flank. You guys deploy in the house. You guys will act as support. And you guys come right up the middle. You're actually going to be within too close to them so they can't shoot. Then these units are going to be the ones that will have to take the hits. Load them down. See? Just burning them alive. More horse down. That's weird, they couldn't all make it inside the house. These guys are standing. Can we go in? <laughs> Let me in! Hey, firing, boys. Nice, just busting glass and shooting at him. It's so cool. Oh, I thought you guys were gonna go faster. Um. Keep moving. You guys can't even form a square in here, can you? Can you? I'm trying. <laughs> what a funky battle this is. Look at this street fighting. Oh my gosh. Get in position. Get in position. We'll hold them. That's oh, why the square for Darth Maul is a lot bigger than the <laughs> vanilla. That, but then the unit is bigger, so it makes sense. You know, there's a lot more men here. We're holding them back. They may be winning here, but as soon as these guys prepare to fire, there's going to be a lot of dead horse. And I'm waiting for it. And you guys are doing well, winning slightly. Are you guys, uh... Any second now. I know it's been difficult to get in this position, but here. Prepare to fire. And fire. Yeah. You're not gonna win that. Alright, so get out of square formation. Reform these lines. At the run, boys. Alright. Got no Marines. The road is clear. Forward, march. Line infantry. Right flank. Forward. Dragoons. Clean up the routers, please. How it says. Prepare to fire. Taking this house was such a great idea. Wow. No! Oh, oh, nicely shot. Well done, Howitzer team. Well done. Uh, you guys are blasting the hell out of this house. Forward! Forward! Let's go! Right face! Up and over the fence, boys! Reform the lines! Shoot! 
Drop it right there, howitzer. Right there. Right down the whole line. Yep, here it comes. Boom! Oh! Just laid him out! Oh, it's so much damage. Oh my gosh. They came back. Let's see. Gotta get you guys out of here. Don't get shot. Make us to your hill. You guys as well. Forward. Forward. You know what? Just chase him off the map here. Just get him. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, not again, not again, not again. No. I just totally decimated my own line infantry. Oh, this is the worst luck I've had with these cannons. Yes, look at him go with the sword over his head. Oh, we're going up and over the fence. Oh, I'm following the man with the sword. Headshot! Ah! Yeah! Get him! Die! Stab him. Come on. We dodged it. Come on, we're still in the fight. Oh, we died. There's another charge. Run away, you dirty natives. Run away. Can't believe I massacred another line of guys here with that stupid carcass shot. Oh. Wow. Oh, don't, don't, don't continue in charging or anything. This was the unit, huh, that got hit. Oh, man, I can't believe it. Go, Marines! Oh, stabbed him in the face with a bayonet. Come on, how do you... Come on. They don't even have bayonets. Oh, you can see that guy in the distance. Oh, damn. Oh. Pretty wicked to get stabbed by a bayonet. These things are pretty long. There it is. We will end this heroic victory, and uh, once again, I will have an extreme night of sadness for massacring my own boys with the friendly fire. I really got to be faster about as soon as I think to charge my guys to stop shooting my artillery. Oh, but. There you have it. Alright. Chance to recover from battles. Reach and occupy. We got it back. Okay. We'll just have to pay the money to retrain the boys. And if there's any left over here, we'll retrain. And we will catch them next turn and that's going to wrap up this part anyways so next turn next part we will be figuring out uh, how to deal with this new territory that's going to be taken over hopefully not maybe we'll save it and we'll get it back with this army and then all we have to do is rid them of the Car uh, the caribbean down here but that's it for uh, the the brits up here and we're doing a fantastic job hope you all enjoyed this part give a thumbs up and a comment at the bottom especially want to see how long the cherokees Oh, excuse me, how long we're going to allow the Cherokees to live?
right? Because we can go and take them now. We've got multiple armies in the vicinity to do it. And what's our next move? You let me know. I'm still at Fort 2.0, and I'll see you all next time.